This video is dedicated to all the rotary engine enthusiasts across the world. In this video, we are going to be removing a 12A rotary engine from my 72 RX2, and then we are going to proceed to install a high performance, built from scratch, 13B engine and five speed RX7 transmission. and polish the housing on this alternator to make it look a little nicer under the hood. Polishing compound. This is exactly what I did with the rotor housings and the front cover, as you will see in my photographs, before the engine was assembled. I just wanted this engine to look beautiful after it was installed. Coming out pretty nice. This will look great on the engine. Right now I'm getting ready to install a Holley 600 CFM carburetor. It's the brand new carburetor that I bought from Racing Beat, which is a rotary performance supplier. It's hard to believe that this small engine can handle 
a carburetor of this size. That just simply is mind-blowing to me. of this project is to install these MSD monster ignition modules and blaster coils. I am going to try to mount these somewhere right in this area here. We are getting ready to start up this high performance RX2 for the first time here. We don't know what to expect, but we do have fuel, spark, and compression, and it cranks. So here it goes. We just finished installing a cherry bomb glass pack because running an open header, it just got to be a little bit annoying with the neighbors coming up wondering what's going on over here at the shop. But anyway, this is just temporary so we can set our timing and do a little tuning today. And after that, we're going to run a full stainless steel exhaust all the way back custom built. Let's fire this thing up.
Thank you very much for watching Project Mazda RX-2. If you like vintage and modern rotary cars, the smell of race gas and old gas, interest in vintage gas pumps, please hit the subscribe button below and hit the notification button so you will be notified of all my future videos. Thank you for watching.